crawfish boil COVID edition. What this really means is that it's just for me and the wife because the, the kid doesn't like crawfish. So this is a 10 pound sack. What I was told, picked up at 10 o'clock in the morning for about a 4 p.m. boil. First step is I like, always like to do is let these guys soak in water for a long, long time as possible before you actually cook it. The best method, of course, is to have water drain through the crawfish so it can drain, come in, and also go out. So all the dirty water is going to be going out as clean water comes in. And better already. Now this next step is what I like to do for the crawfish themselves is determine how much water I need to put in for the pot. So you do it off camera, I put in the crawfish into my strainer and then filled it up to filled it up to the appropriate level where they'd be appropriately cooked and boiled in with all the other ingredients. So the crawfish are in there right now. I'm back in the cooler and now I measure it to see where the line is for the water where I can fill it up to right now. So that's how I like to do it. So I'm not putting too 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 much water or too little water for the boil itself. Nothing complicated here. Go ahead and get it started. Slowly creep up on the uh, ignition point. Ignition point for your whatever propane uh, burner you have. This was appropriate. This this was the slap your mama uh, crawfish boil rub for uh, one bag for about 10, 10 to twelve pounds, which was exactly what we had. And this was the initial ingredients what we had in. We put a whole bunch of garlic, put some butter in there, some onions. I forgot to put in lemons, but I did squeeze those on the crawfish at the end. A little salt, and since this is a COVID edition, a couple stuff I didn't have, we just made do without it. A good boil going. Go and start the cooking process with some small potatoes. Again, not much here, just for me and the wife. Get that down for good five ten minutes. Go ahead and put some of your sausage in. Already cooked, already a smoked sausage, so really just heating it up here with some good spices. Now for the fun part, putting them all in. Again, this is this was a small sack, just about ten pounds. So I like to boil my crawfish for about three minutes. So of course you have to get the, it up to temp before you boil it. Make sure you're watching watching it boil itself. Boil for three minutes and then let it rest. Kind of con a little controversial here, to, let it, to get the temperature back down about 160 so the crawfish will sink to the bottom and they'll soak in good, all the good flavors, I put in, I put in ice. You don't have to do that, but it does ensure that the barbecue will try to be, crawfish boil will get down temperature quick enough so you're not gonna overcook the crawfish. There are other contraptions out there to, to cool it down better than what I just did, but I don't, ha but I don't have those. Here comes the best part of me, crawfish boil. Pour it out on the table, out on the outside, in the great outdoors. This is it. Thanks so much for watching the COVID edition. Small little boil for the family. Great times were had by all. Thanks everybody.